You know who's faster than Quicksilver and X-Men? Me, Kyle Montgomery. Recapping the entire 2017 World Tour season in three minutes. Oh, Canada! For its sixth edition, the World Tour paid its first visit to Canada in the streets of Saskatoon. And let me tell you, these Canadian cats watched too much Raptors Vince Carter when they were coming up because they dunks looked awfully similar. Not to say Jurassic, but the Iceman Herzegovac started Ice Age and the reigning champs Ljubljana bagged another title. Stefan Stojic has organized a breakdance battle in the Utsunomiya Fuda Arayama Shrine. The first ever World Tour Mongolian team reached the semifinals, and the number one team in the world, Novi Sad Awara, won their first title of the season. Make that two, one week later, in the UNESCO World Heritage Streets of Prague. Zitlinskas did things a 5'9 dude just ain't supposed to do. Michael Hicks proved that his heart was much bigger than his mouth when he played through the passing of his mom, and Dushan Bullock got his first MVP trophy of the season. Novi Sad Awada said three is a magic number at the Lasan Masters. The home team set the crowd on fire, and Nathan Jerkovic got so high over the rim, we had to call him Swiss Khalifa, especially if he's out there wearing black and yellow, black and yellow, black and yellow. Just in front of Deverson's reformed great church, Alexander Ratko sent the biggest, uh, I mean second biggest, prayer of the season. Stojicic hosted another battle, and the young Lehman team won their first ever World Tour title. In the crowded streets of Chengdu, Piran won their first title in three years. Forget about great pandas. The Sphinx Simon Fitzgar became Chengdu's favorite animal after throwing down alley-oops and icing two free throws with four ticks of a second to go to win the championship. At the Mexico City Masters, FIBA made a donation for every dunk to help with human relief after the earthquake. Chris Staples transformed the Petty Sewer shopping mall into his own Staples Center. The number one player in the world, Dejan Maisolovic, tied the shootout contest all-time record, and Lehman became the team to beat after winning their second Masters in four weeks. The top 12 teams met at the epic Bloomage Beijing final. Novi Sad Awada sent Lehman back to the university library. Zamu Master knocked out the reigning champs Ljubljana, and these two teams gave us the most insane championship game ever. Steve Sir's unlimited range and Lipex Vertige in his vertical were crazy, but nothing compared to Bogdan Dragovic's sick, ridiculous game winner. An absolute insane ending to an amazing season that saw our Facebook page reach 1 million likes. And of course, 3x3 made it from the streets to the Olympics.